Okay, as you already know, um, this week is 4th of July week, and everyone's been uploading some makeup tutorials and stuff, so instead of doing, like, a makeup tutorial, I'm going to do a hair tutorial on how to get, like, 4th of July inspired hair. So, stay tuned for the tutorial. Okay, so we're not going to be, like, straightening your hair, waving your hair, curling it, or anything like that. We are going to be doing, um, something, it's, like, like hair chalking. So what you're going to need, the most important, um, thing that you will need is, so uh, soft pastels. And, um, they sell, like, hair chalks and stuff, but I feel like these work better. So, um, also you're going to need some water and a straightener and a hairbrush. So what you're gonna, you're going to start by doing is taking like any section of hair that you want to basically like dye I guess so I'm gonna do this piece and you're going to get it wet okay so I got it wet with the water that I had in my cup and then you're going to take a hair pastel in any color that you want but I'm going to be using a like American flag red this kind of looks pink on the camera but it's red and you're going to once you got your hair wet you're going to rub it in your hair like this and since I have darker hair, it's a lot harder to get it to show up. But, and you can even wet the pastel, that helps too. And it will just start dyeing your hair. You can see that it is getting red, like, yeah, you see the red. Okay. Like that. And your hair does get kind of knotted from doing this. And it also can kind of dye your hands and your clothes a little bit. But it comes out. So there is that one. Can't really see it that great. But that's just one. And then we are going to repeat this step with different colors to get red, white, and blue in our hair. Okay, so I continued to um chalk my hair. And you do the same thing for all of it. You just wet the hair and take the chalk and then rub it on. And as you can see, there's some red and some blue in there. And so then once you uh, get your desired amount of highlights, you are going to straighten over them and this is going to lock in the color. So you're just going to, and make sure it's dried though, and it might dye your straightener a little bit, but it's okay, like it'll come out. I'm going to chalk over, uh, straighten over all of the areas that you put like um, the dye, the chalk in. So this is the finished look. And it shows up a lot better on blonde hair, like I said, but it still shows up a little bit on mine. But I hope you guys liked it, so keep watching on Sundays for more videos.